Hey guys, so today I'm going to be teaching you how to do old CGI renders like this in in Blender and stuff. Since not much people not much people talk about how to do this. So yeah, basically I got a little, little pack um just for this. So yeah. So uh first of all, you want to you want to go on my you want to go on my description and you want to you want to go on my drive and you want to download this this thing called called that that's what it's called. And you download it. You just get a little bit, you get a little bit, and boom, it's it's been downloaded. You open up your then you open your up your blender and you and then you, and then you uh and then you open up your file. So now that you have your blender open and also the file, now you now you get to now you get to do the modeling part. So uh first of all you just delete these. I don't know why you won't want these. And you delete that, you delete that too. Well, unless you want it. I do, so I'm keeping it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna make a little hammer. I'm gonna make a little hammer as a as use example. So, yeah. Start the, start, the, start, the, start the time lapse. So now that you have your model finished, um, now, now it's time to add the textures. So first you, you, you add the texture, then you go to, then you go to shading. Now, uh, turn on this thing right here, yeah? Turn on that. Now you get the, now you see that. Now, uh, go to groups and add fungi. And then, uh... And then if you wanna if you wanna add a little little texture, you can uh, do something with the with the uh, automatically generated textures since a lot of old CGI used um, automatic textures and stuff. So yeah. So now that you have your thing, I have your little little texture. And you just gotta um I gotta do the mid color. And yeah. So this thing is for my, for the, uh, ba for my, yeah, it's supposed to be wood, for my hammer. Look at that. Well, it looks like wood, kinda, a little bit. If you wanna make, if you wanna, if we do a step further, further, uh, do this, the, and, and that, now, now you got a bump, now you got a null map for it. So now you got the texture. Now this this one's special because this is this is supposed to be made of metal as hammers are. So if you want to make a metal texture, do do new one, do new one. You know how it is. Do new thing. Remove this, and instead of the fungi, you add um, metal. So yeah, it's just basically a modified version of fungi to make it look like metal. Doesn't quite look like it here, but I'm just gotta modify the settings a little bit. All right, so now you get the little metal look right here, kind of, and you, then you apply it to the rest of the stuff. Yeah. Now you got some metal. Look at that. So if you want to add um, reflections to your model, uh, all you gotta do is do add shader. And add the glossy BSDF. Now make sure to turn it, the roughness down all the way, because you know it doesn't it doesn't look quite retro that way. So yeah, if you want to turn turn down, if you want to make the glossy less visible, just turn down turn the brightness down and the color. And yeah. Now if you want if you want if you want if you don't want your model to look dark like this, you know, uh use this right here. Do not don't you don't change the uh don't change it here cuz then it's going to add um a little bit of uh anti-aliasing and that just doesn't that just doesn't look very good. This is basically just a workaround that that takes away all the anti-aliasing and makes it a little look a lot more retro. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Now, you get to render it. So yeah, now you're just gonna render it. And then boom. Get a little bit, and yeah, there we go. Look at that. 
Now that's that's retro right there. And yep, that's pretty much it. Thank you. Bye bye. Also, if you want to add a light to your scene, um, make sure the radius is zero. And if you're picking air area, um, make sure the beam spread is also zero. Just make sure there's no there's no none of that, or else the shadows will be blurred and stuff, and that won't look really good.